All right. We're back again. I'm so excited. We're probably going to finish this game. Um, come on. Oh, there we go. All right. We left on a cliffhanger right before this break. We're after Mr. Moneybags. Uh, our team is going to find out soon that we participated as a tough fluff and we're going to get uh, the Ask Me problem. Anyway, I already have something lined up for when we finish this and we'll chill with a little bit of that after this. So, oh yeah, we don't want a mouse. That's all we want. We want to continue. <coughs> Excuse me. All right. We got to go. We're chasing, we're chasing Mr. Moneybags. Oh, why did we go to the elevator? Gotta go out the door. Out the door. You won't get away with our Gobblebot money bags. After him. We're all freaking out. Everybody's freaking out. We're freaking out. Get back here! We're freaking out! We're freaking out, man! Is he- did he run here? Or did he run somewhere else? Feels like this is where he would run. Like this is his home turf or whatever. I guess not. Oh, we should just look for him. Where did they go? Where did they go? The apartment building? No. He's hiding. He's hiding. There he is. Not there. There. He's over by the stairs. Look, I'm going faster than all of you, and I can barely catch him. So. I got you. Stop. Eh. Eh. Stop. I have you now. This is a dead end. Choices. We have you trapped! Oh. Poppy! Stop that guy! Get him, my sweeties! Da 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 da! Ah! Bad bot! Bad bot! Shoo! Nice try, Spark. Why are you at Sorrel's house? Nettle! Get the Gobobot! <laughs> We're like calling everybody in on this. Get your filthy paws away from me! It's okay, Nettle. Rage on! Oh my goodness. Is it my house? No. Uh, no. Okay, we already did that one, so. Park! This is great. I love this whole sequence. There he is! Fellow bots, this is Flitter OS! Stop that organic! 
Affirmative. <laughs> Could just I should be able to just grab it. Stay away. You're going to get my suit dirty. <sighs> Missed by a floating point error. All right. We're downtown. He's running out of gas. Stop him before he gets to his office. We'll get him first. Let's go, Tufts. Herc, come on. Chive, why are you stopping? This is getting us nowhere. Robo Chive 2.0. Welcome to Mart Mart. Get the Gobobot. I run faster than all of you. Come on, come on. Chive, it's glitching out. What's happening? I must have messed up the wiring with the confetti canyons. Cannons. Party time! Uh oh. Watch out! Uh. Oh. oh, the tough the tough thing fell out of our pocket. Oh, he got away! We failed, we failed, we failed! Chive, why'd you bring that bot? We could have had him if it didn't come in and ruin everything. I was just trying to help. Help? <clears throat> How much help that was? He got away! No one's to blame. You didn't help either, Lavender. You're being mean. I'm being mean? I... What's this? Is this... From the tough fluffs? Fennel. I thought, were you gonna join them? They just wanted to have. I knew it! You betrayed me! How could you? I didn't. <clears throat> You're out of the fluff squad! Sorrel? That's messed up, Sorrel. <clears throat> First the arcade, now my friends! Everything is leaving! I'm out of here! Sorrel, wait! <clears throat> I'm sorry, Fennel. You okay? Yeah. I knew it. I knew this was gonna happen. At least it wasn't all of them. It was just uh, Sorrel that got mad at us. <clears throat> also, they're inside with money bags right now? Hold on. That's, uh... They're inside with money bags? Anyway. I'm gonna go. Oh, I can. All I can do is go back to Button City. I can't go home. Poor Fennel. Uh, are we in dream reality right now? Uh, that's what's happening here. Uh, okay. Hey! Hey, Tigress, how you doing? Hey, Tiger, how you doing? Yes, I am streaming. This is uh, the late chill stream that I do on Fridays. Uh, we are finishing Button City, and then I am probably going to do some chill vampire survivors, actually. Yeah, no, I'm glad you made it. Um, uh, 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 uh. <clears throat> we are apparently trapped in our own head right now. Oh, no, that's our mom. Oh, it's our mom. This is our mom we're seeing. Your... Why? We're stuck. We're stuck in a walk animation. Oh, there's the toast again. Why the toast? He. The. Oh, the toast. The. Uh. I think we've stayed out in the rain because we were sad because our. Because our, Sorrel threw us out of the fluff squad. 
Uh, and now we are sick. Now we are very ill. Left. Are we talking about our dad? Because our dad is, like, super gone. Like, our dad is not... This is a great game, by the way. Um, there's the, the jelly toast. The jelly! The candies! Oh! Who are you? Life getting too fast? Don't spin out. Oh, these are uh, characters from Revolution Racer. We haven't played that a lot because it's really hard. It's one of the mini games uh, in the game, so. You gotta go at it with all your heart, even if it's not enough. Yeah, okay. And then this is gonna be... Oh, the Dance Dance game. Maybe. Or Gobobots. Those are all of our Gobobots. Nothing is more important in this galaxy than the connections we share. Oh, these are the Gobobots for our team, actually. I'll always be there for my friends. But what if I'm not good enough? <clears throat> but Protag's name is Emi. Oh, yeah, yeah, because they talked to us about that. I can do anything with my friends by my side. Through the power of will and friendship, we can do anything. Move all this stuff out of the way. Oh, okay. It's cilantro. Is this... Oh, the lemonade. Is this actually cilantro or is this uh, fake new cilantro? Because actual cilantro has left this universe. They keep slicing. And they never stop. It's like they can't, or else. <clears throat> uh. Oh, we are having problems now. We started slicing to help out, but there are so many lemons to cut. It's never enough. This is like a, the most surreal experience we've had in this game. Amazing timing coming in in this moment when like nothing else in the game has been like this. <clears throat> Excuse me. When will it be enough? Whenever we get enough. It just wants more. Tough. What about you, Sesame? Never stop. Never relax. Must slice. Always slice. And then garlic in the back. Oh, they're still slicing. Slicing. Slice. Never enough. Slice. Never enough. Okay. No thinking. Just slicing. Lavender! Lavender and chive, you're trapped. <clears throat> no matter how much we slice, it's never enough. My hands hurt, but I'm afraid to stop. Oh, Mr. Money Bags! Oh, and the paperwork. Then here's Mr. Button slash Chorzo or Corzo. Fennel! I don't want to leave, but I can't stop him. He's too big. It's Mr. Moneybags! <clears throat> no, we are very ill. <clears throat> we are very ill. Oh, jeez. Minigame? Nope. We're sleeping. In the rain. Outside of Bun City. No. Stay away. Time to wake up. Uh, come on, little one. You're going to get a crook neck sleeping out here. Yeah! 
Oh, didn't mean to scare you there. M Mr. Button, what are you doing here so late? I could ask you the same thing, Fennel. I'm sorry. We didn't mean to trespass and make the place spooky and run away. Then what did you mean to do? We, uh, we were trying to scare away money bags by making Button City seem haunted. <laughs> that sounds like a fun plan. You're not mad? Well, I like the decorations. I always liked spooky things. Although I don't think they scared Pepperbottom. <clears throat> Mr. Button? Hmm? Why are you letting him take the arcade? Growing up is tough, Fennel. Sometimes things happen that are beyond your control. You make with it what you will. I've gotten really sick, Fennel. Sick? What if I made you some soup? <laughs> That'd be nice. But it's not that kind of sickness. This is the kind that doesn't go away so easily. Oh. I can get a treatment that might make me better, but it costs a lot of money that I don't have. So, I have to say goodbye to Button City. I love this place. So many memories. So many kids grew up here. I'll miss it too. Thank you for caring, little one. But it's late, and it wouldn't be right to let you sleep out here. Go home, where it's warm. Tomorrow will be a new day. Bye, Mr. Button. Bye, Fennel. Thanks for stopping by. Mr. Button is too good of a person. Mr. B I love Mr. Button. Mr. Mr. Button is amazing. I heart Mr. Button. And now we're going to go home and our mom's going to yell at us. And we're going to be sad. And then she's going to stop. Found the Cozy Game Fields card they drew from the tech. I know, right? Mr. Button is sick. I don't like that. I'm not a fan. Oh, there's Mom. Mom. Fennel, where have you been? I've been trying to message you all night. I was about to call the cops. Mom, I'm sorry I was out so late. We broke into Button City, and we made it look all spooky, and the Tough Loves came and challenged us to Gobobots, and we won the Golden Gobobot, and then Mr. Button showed up and scared everyone, and then Moneybags, who's shutting down the arcade, stole the Golden Gobobot, and then we chased him all over, and then Chive sent a bot after him, and it got his wires crossed and crashed and exploded, and then Soro got mad and kicked me out of the Fluff Squad. She hates me now. We were just trying to save the arcade, Mom. And worst of all, Mr. Button's sick, Mom, and he can't afford treatment. That's why he's selling the arcade to money bags. What's a Gobobot? And who's money bags? And did you say something exploded? I'm worried about Mr. Button. Have you told him what he means to you and your friends? No. Well, since the arcade means so much to you and your friends, you should let him know. Yeah, I can do that. But not tonight. It's way too late now. Go to bed. I'll let you off with a warning. Don't make me worry like that again. Okay, Mom. Good night. <clears throat> Mom's like, What's a Gobobot? Because we haven't been able to, like, talk to her the entire... Ever since we got, like, the since the beginning of this game. We haven't really had a conversation with her. So she doesn't know that we are a arcade gaming wizard. Um, okay, Fennel. You got this. Best friend. Like, did you say something exploded? <clears throat> are you bleeding? That's what it should have been followed with. Are you bleeding? Um, you just have to find everyone who goes to Button City. Let's see. There's lavender, chive, sorrel, licorice, cilantro, and the tough fluffs. This will be easy. Let's go. There's a lot more than that. Because we've had a lot of people we run into. That have been like, I go to I go to Button City. <clears throat> Candy. I'm not going to check all these things. Because we already know that we have enough buttons. 
Is mom at work already? <gasps> the jam toast is gone. That's nerve wracking. All right. Out the door. Oh, hi, cilantro. What are you doing outside my house? <clears throat> so, Mr. Button is selling Button City because he's sick? Yeah. It's not right. You'd think that it would end with something bigger. Like a bot attack, or space aliens, or monsters from beyond this realm. Not something so real. I know. I'm gonna miss it. We're gonna go say goodbye to Button City and thank Mr. Button for everything. I'll bring my camera. All right, let's get the hard one over with. You're not tripping all over the carpet, are you? Please don't let your upholstery. That was the rule when I was a kid, though. Like, because my sister and I kind of... My sister was the babysitter. So, like... Like, that was the rule. When mom came home from work, or when dad came home from work, nobody could be bleeding. No bleeding. That's That was the hard and fast rule. No bleeding. <laughs> all right, let's get the hard one. Ugh. Alright, Sorrel. Go away! I don't want to talk to anyone! Alright. <clears throat> I think we're gonna have to call in the cavalry to pry Sorrel out of her room. Next. Oh, the voice recorder's back. How you holding up? Good. I slept outside Button City. Sounds uncomfortable. It was just a nap. I guess that's not so bad. So, Mr. Button is closing up today? Yeah, he's sick. And he has to sell Button City so he can afford to get better. That's really unfair. He didn't ask to get sick. Feels like he's being double punished for something he can't control. I'm trying to find everyone so we can say goodbye to Button City and thank Mr. Button. I'll be there. Spread the word! Spread the word! Alright, we can't do Sorrel's house. Keep going. Downtown. Who's in downtown? Maybe the Tough Fluffs? I mean, Lavender is in the park. I can see her. I go in the back room, they're just going to have me do the concert again, so. <clears throat> Let's do Lavender. Hey, Fennel. Are you okay? We were all worried about you after you left. Yeah. I fell asleep outside Button City. Why would you do that? I don't know. But I went home after Mr. Button woke me up. <clears throat> he told me why he's selling. He's sick, and he can't get better unless he sells the arcade so he can afford treatment. Is he going to be okay? I hope so. I wanted to get everyone together to say goodbye to Button City and thank Mr. Button. That sounds really nice. I'll let others know, and I'll definitely be there. <clears throat> All right. We need tough bluffs. Uh, ha. <clears throat> Sup, twerp. We're getting everyone from the arcade to say goodbye to Mr. Bu to Button City and thank Mr. Button. Hmm. That sounds nice. Did you ever find out why he's selling? He's sick and can't afford treatment. I see. Same thing happened to my dad. Everyone in my family came together to help pay, but not everyone is lucky. It's a rotten system that kicks you while you're still down. That is spicy, and I'm not going to dig into it. <laughs> I'll be there. Thanks for telling me. 
All right. So, Button City is closed right now, right? Or is it open? Is Button City... Okay, Button City is open. So... <clears throat> Basil's here. Do you want to buy a snack? Uh, oh. Hold on here. <clears throat> Sorrel, go to the like a spicy trues, cough cough, right? Go to the tough fluff hideout. Where the hell is that? Have I found that place yet? That's like where do they uh, where do they hide out? I'm not seeing a specific Gotta be in downtown somewhere. No, because the record shop is not available. I want to read this. Maybe I'll tell me where the hideout is. <laughs> I mean, I don't think their hideout is just upstairs at Button City. But we'll go look. Yeah, no. Their hideout is not just upstairs at Button City. Park, maybe. Yeah, but, um, look that uh, lavender was in the park. So that makes me less inclined to think it's in the park. Inside the slide, maybe? They said they found the, the tough stuff was found on a bench in the park. Hmm. Maybe in the sewers. <laughs> no, it's not in the sewers. Let's check here. Okay, it's locked. Climb up. <laughs> Be four pieces of trash. You know, they're okay. Especially sesame. Sesame's cool. I, li I like sesame. Sesame's okay. Hmm, this is difficult. Maybe I have to get Sorrel first. Sorrel is top on the list. Let's try again. Okay, here we go. Hey, Sorrel. I wanted to say I'm sorry. It's not your fault. I shouldn't have blown up at you. Everything was slipping from my grasp. The arcade, the golden gobobot, my friends. Then I saw the tough fluff zine and I couldn't handle it. Why do you hate tough fluff so much? They have what I wanted. What? Fennel. I started the tough fluffs. You were right. It was... It was Sorrel. <clears throat> Wait, you're the tough one? Yeah. You did call it. Yes, you did. I created the tough fluffs, the rules of tough, and even a clubhouse. It was all about being kind and tough for each other. I tried to invite others by giving out the zine, but everyone was scared of me. Everyone thought I was a bad kid, up to no good. It did. It, the tail it was for me. I was like, oh. So I cast my pleather jacket away. And then one day, I saw Saffron with my old jacket, saying she and her friends are the tough fluffs. No one was scared of them. Everyone thought they were cool. They all looked so happy. I hated her. She stole the tough fluffs from me. When I saw you in the zine, it was like she was stealing my friends, too. But you didn't do anything wrong. I'm sorry, Fennel. 
Is there anything I can do to make it up to you? Well, Mr. Button told me why he's selling Button City. We're gathering everyone to say goodbye to the arcade and thank Mr. Button. You should come. Wouldn't miss it. I also want to invite the Tough Fluffs, but I don't know where they are. I'll show you. The clubhouse is in a secret area in the park, past the gate. Okay, so it's in the park, but it is past the gate. Hey, Fennel. Yeah? Thanks for being a good friend. You too, Sorrel. Let's head over to the park. Dun -dun 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 -dun. At least she's not mad at us anymore. Da -da 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 -da. Oh, that's what I forgot to do. One second. I gotta do this or my lipstick will literally disintegrate. Protective co top coat. So that I can actually look like I have some kind of color and not just look like a ghost. Complete ghost. Alright. I almost forgot. <clears throat> <laughs> Mizzy Ghost Gaming. I mean, someday I'll figure out the lighting and the monitor lighting so that I don't look like I'm literally been dipped in white paint. <laughs> bones, bones through the heart. Tough Fluff Super Secret Hideout. Stay away, Fluff Squad. Everyone else is welcome. All right, is there a piece of trash somewhere back here? Maybe it's inside. Looks like a couple of fluffs lost their way. If you're looking for the golden Gobobot, we don't have it. Moneybags took it up to his gilded tower before we could catch him. That's not why we're here. Then why are you here, Bluff Squad? Sorrel wanted to say something. What? I never said... We might never get to hang out with them again. You're right. Tough Fluffs, Saffron. I'm sorry for being so mean to you. We could have been friends, but I was mad because I thought you stole it. Stole what? The tough fluffs. I'm the tough one. <laughs> Gasp. You, the tough one? But you spit on the very name of tough. Look at the tag on the jacket. Sesame, can you look? Hmm, yep. Says Sorrel. Wait, you never read the tag? Who reads the tag? How will you know how to wash it? I don't wash it. Ew. Ugh, whatever. So you're the tough one. What's that matter? Nothing, really. You took the rules of tough and made the tough fluffs into something great. Oh, well. Thanks. Anyway, Button City is closing. We want everyone to come together as friends. Tough fluffs, fluff squad, and everyone else to say goodbye to it. Mm, well, you did make something really rad. Even though we're rivals, we should come together for the community. It's the tough way. We'll be there. See you at Button City. Alright. Dun dun. Oh, wait. I go back in. In. Alright. There's a bunch of junk laying around, but I don't think any of it qualifies as garbage. So we did just miss a piece of garbage somewhere. Which is annoying. Whatever. It's fine. Not worried about it. Oh. Oh, I can't. This is a special. Oh, wow. All right. Oh my, did you all come for me? 
Mr. Button, thank you for the arcade. It was a ton of fun, Mr. Button. Thanks for all the memories, Mr. Button. Go get better. Get lots of rest. And make sure to stay hydrated. And listen to good music. Tough. Sorry I said that your soda machines had nanobots and used mind control. Thanks for the chill job. And for letting me loiter. Thank you for helping create so many friendships. Oh, everyone. Thank you all for coming out. It means so much to me. All the memories I'll have with this place. Button City will live on in my heart. Corzo! Why are there so many people here? You still need to sign the papers. Here, everyone, take a flyer. <laughs> it's for the grand opening of the big box mart. Oh, my mom is here, actually. You'll have rows and rows of sale items. You won't need this dirty little arcade anymore. Or any other store, for that matter. My carrot dogs and slushes will be premium. That dingy little Mart Mart can't possibly compete. It'll shut down that hipster cafe with the mediocre lattes. And get rid of that filthy noise you youth call music. Only the smoothest contemporary jazz from my store. No more stuffy library. Free books ruin the market anyway. I hate that. I hate that. I hate that. Oh. Oh. That's a good way to get busy. Spicy. I hate that. I hate all of that. This whole town is so unfashionable. Not a single suit inside except mine. No more tasteless, moldy, rotten fruit. We'll only stock the biggest, most perfect looking fruit. Everything else goes straight in the dumpster. And that trash heap. Why fix your junk when you can buy new stuff? From me. A true utopia for the unthinking masses. I'm going to put you in a rocket and you can go to outer space and stay there. Hey, hey! Put me down this instant! No, don't! 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 We just threw him off the world! Whoa! Lost out! Lost out! We literally threw him into the void and now he's falling forever. What is this universe? So, there have been a lot of different things that have happened in this game that, like, the overall world structure has come into question. But this moment, in and of itself, is probably the scariest moment that's happened in the entire game because of what it implies. <laughs> ah, get me down from here! We don't want a big box, big box mart taking over. Yeah, we'd rather have the arcade. But how am I supposed to afford my treatment? We'll all chip in. I'll rally everyone in town and we'll hold a fundraiser. Mr. Button, let us all help you. Please. You have the best games. And the most fun place to hang out. We wouldn't be the Fluff Squad without you. And we wouldn't be the Tough Fluffs. You helped make so many people happy. So please, Mr. Button, don't sell the arcade. Thank you, everyone. That would mean so much to me. Yay! We have saved Button City! Yes! Huzzah! Good job, Fennel. Now let's go play at the arcade. Yay! And uh, money bags can fall forever. We'll, we'll help him at some point. Money bags can just keep falling. He's fine. I knew we were very close to the end of this game. By the way, I could tell in my story bones. Just falling forever in the background of a dance party. Yes. Yes. Credits. Yay! Wow. So, I actually finished that entire game, like, yesterday and today. <laughs> it's so good, though. Like, that game is so good, though. Um, 
save money bags for the last piece of trash, right? Oh my god. I will probably hunt down the last piece of trash. Um, I don't think there's probably... I mean, the game is saved. New Game Plus is probably just, like, um, finishing up your collections and all that kind of stuff. We already have all of the Gobobots, and if we don't have all of the cosmetics, we have uh, cosmetics slash buffs slash all that stuff, we have clothes. So, this is a game that I know I'm gonna... Hi, baby. This is the game I know I'm gonna run again um, when I get a uh, copy on a platform with achievements. I know that I'll run it again. Because I love this game. This game was amazing. This game was amazing. I'm so glad I played it. I loved it. It was so much fun. By the way, this does not mean the stream is over. <laughs> because I know we're only 40 minutes in. It's okay. It's okay. Um... Oh, he's still... <laughs> Here comes Garlic. Garlic's got him. Are you going to push him off? You can't do anything about it. And the spreadsheet needs to be updated more than once a month. Too bad. And he's got the gold Gobo bot. We earned that. Am I gonna have to buy it from Licorice? Oh. Licorice. Don't be garbage, man. I won that. I won that fair and square. I don't know if I can afford it. I've been spending. Golden Gobabot. Only if you defeat me in Goba battle, twerp. I thought you said you don't play. I was the former grand champ. So in other words, I lied. All right. So one final Gobabot game, I guess. To get the golden Gobobot because I'm not ending the game without having it. I don't know how this is gonna go, but because he is the grand champion, grand champion licorice. I feel like this is gonna be really difficult, Citrana. We need to go with what we won't know works: Jelly Bop, Crush Berry, Pinerang. Ooh, the music is different. Oh my God, he has one. Okay, so. We just kind of have to be careful. Alright, where is he? Why do we only have four? Oh, it's not giving us double. It only gives him double. It's only, yes, the golden robot makes them worth four. Okay. But he's also slow. So, we just have to keep pushing. Oh, no! Run! Thank you, Jelly Bob! Your sacrifice, your sacrifice will not go unnoticed. What? He's gonna come get me. Like, I got a deposit. He's gonna murder me. And then we're gonna be behind. Nine! <laughs> Alright. Okay. Okay, we're in a good place. Oh no! Oh! We were in a good place. <laughs> Stay away from me. Okay, okay. There we go. And this music is a jam. I'm watching for him. He's scary. Because he's beating us. Like. Did 
because that's the hard part of this. Like, you have to beat him when he has a very distinct advantage. Like, we need to get more because we are literally just one away from him being higher than us again. So, we gotta wa I gotta watch out. Alright, I'm gonna go across. He's here somewhere. Oh my goodness. Really? Yes, that. We need that. Okay. Alright. 46. Okay. Oh no, don't touch me. Don't, don't touch me. No, it hurts me. Oh, my heart. All right. We only have 15 seconds left. Y'all, keep it together. We got this. Keep it together, bots. Who are all dead? No, no, no. Are you kidding me? Oh my god. My heart. That was so close. Who did it? I want to know. I want to know who the bot was that turned in those three berries in the last five seconds. Because you saved the You're the VIP. You saved the day. Oh my god. Uh. Also, I just saw that, Phoenix. Yes, I also wish that Moneybags was falling forever during the credits. That would have been amazing. Oh, <clears throat> oh my goodness. I got worked up. Hmm. Good job, twerp. Seems you got pretty good at the gotten pretty good at the game. You and Red and the Hammer were all dead. It was Pinerang. <laughs> it was my very first one. It was Pinerang. It was the one he sold me. That's ironic. Here, you deserve Hydra Tetrafoot Hyper Tetrafoot AX. Got it. Have fun. Now it's mine, and I got a million tickets. Okay. Cool. That's good. Game just saved. So. Alright. Give me just a minute. I'm not going to mute or anything. I'm just going to put it on the break screen. Or actually, we just put it on the screen. Alright. The hangout screen. You'll notice I have no one right now because they're butts. Alright. So. We want to go here, and then go to this. 